welcome to budget with me in this video we will actually be doing my week four budgeting video um i didn't pre-plan this normally i pre-plan my videos however <laughs> i didn't pre-plan this i'm kind of winging this because i have a bunch of videos to record i have to record the cash stuffing I have to record my savings challenge saturday i have a how-to video that i have to record um and I'm also doing, oh, my bill exchange condensing video. I have to do that video. So I've got a few videos that I have to record this week. <sighs> and I'm going to be busy. <laughs> I also am doing a um, 2023, like how I'm going to be doing my budgeting for 2023. I also have that video to do. So I have a bunch of videos that I have to do with not a lot of time. Um, as you guys know, if you read my community post, my twins are sick. Um, one of them is very sick. Uh, he does have a really bad cough. So, um, we're having to deal with that. But, I mean, he's okay. It's not like he has a fever or anything like that. It's just a cough. And it's just, he's not sleeping comfortably. Like, right now is the only time he's sleeping comfortable. Like, I wanted to record this video way earlier. Um, and I just couldn't do it. Um, I'm actually recording it Saturday instead of Sunday. Because, um you know tomorrow is christmas so merry christmas or should i say happy holidays because everyone doesn't celebrate christmas i'll say um happy holidays to respect anyone's religion um so happy holidays to everyone um so i'm recording it saturday night because you know for me i celebrate christmas and i'm of course going to be spending it with family so i knew i wouldn't have time to record my budget with me video so i didn't even want to put you guys through that and be like oh i'm gonna get it done and then nah, i'm really not gonna get it done um so that is that uh what else did i want to say oh thank you to anyone who has been supporting my etsy shop i so greatly appreciate you guys like i never would have thought that i would make the sales that i made and the few sales that i have made thank you guys so much i'm so glad that everyone is liking the products i have tweaked a few of my products you know because of reviews that i've gotten um or just like you know like my standards of how i want things to look so just know some things have changed um to my giveaway uh winners i am waiting on i think three or four winners to contact me i think it's three i believe it's three i'm still waiting on three people to contact me again i did say you guys had until sunday but because sunday is christmas i don't want to make you guys have to stress about that i'm going to give you guys until monday to contact me regarding your giveaway prize if not <laughs> i don't know <laughs> But, um, oh, I'm sorry, guys. I keep kicking the, the stand because it's literally, like, right by my feet. <laughs> Let me just... Sorry. I'm gonna figure it out. Um, and then the shadow that it's casting is from my ring light. I have it up higher than I normally have it. And I'm trying to see how that works out for me as, as far as the glare. So, I'm gonna keep it in that angle for my next couple videos to see how the glare looks. Um... But yeah, let's just jump right into this. I'm not going to break down each individual thing. I did some side hustles. I have my regular um, income that I did for my deliveries this week and then my Etsy page. So I'm just going to put income here because I honestly don't remember the breakdowns, but I did round it um, down. It is a little bit over this, but I just rounded down and kept the rest in buffer. Um, but it is $1,500 for the week that we will be cash stuffy um and i'm not gonna rewrite all my bills and everything like that so if you guys use my digital planner if you don't want to keep like rewriting the same things over and over you actually let me zoom in so you can see actually um let me zoom in on the camera so you see like this little lasso tool here so this allows you to like pick anything up on the screen so i'm gonna show you exactly what i'm talking about let me zoom back out so you just have to go around whatever it is you're trying to pick up and you want to hold it down and it gives you the option to copy it. Now, if I didn't want to copy it and I just want to move it around, I could just move it. Like I could literally move all of that, but we're going to put that back where it was. <laughs> and you hold down on your screen again and you do paste and then you can move it to wherever it needs to go. And I'm just doing it like this so I can save a little bit of time on um you know 
writing this all out. I couldn't get my words out. Okay, so I am going to erase everything here. And I also need to erase one more thing. So my bills, I, I stuff the same amount every single week. This never changes. Um, however, for this month, if you watch my other videos, I have not cashed off health insurance, nor have I cashed off water, only because I think I have enough to cover that for the month of January. Um, water, I'm a little skeptical about. I haven't gotten a bill yet. I'm going to double check before I do my condensing video if I've gotten a bill. If not, I'm just going to pull what I have out of there. And like I said, I have more in buffer to cover it if I need to cover it. Um, but the other change that we need to make is to Navy Federal. So my Navy Federal card, I actually paid the card off. Actually, I didn't want to erase all of it. I paid the card off. So I had money in my Navy Federal savings account that I was using to purchase a home a couple years ago. I had never used the money. I never purchased a home. And right now I'm not in a, uh, I'm not gonna say I'm not in a space to put, to purchase a home. The economy is not in a space for me to purchase a home. So I don't feel like right now it is a necessity to purchase a home and I can always build that back up. So what I did was I took the money that was in the savings account and I just paid Navy Federal out. I'm tired of the interest charge. I just paid them out. I still have a good chunk of money in that account, so I'm not too worried about it. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to get them paid off. So what I'm going to do with that $25 that I was giving to Navy Federal, I'm going to move it over to Apple. I'm not going to put it anywhere else. Um, my Apple credit card, I do use it pretty often. I did purchase my iPad on it, so that I'm, be I'm getting billed for every single month. And then I have like my all my insurances are through my Apple credit card. Any like game purchases that I purchase on my phones and things like that is on my credit card. My Apple Music is on my credit card. Like everything's on my. Credit card. Sorry about that, guys. Uh, one of the twins was acting up with his dad. Um, one of them like goes to sleep fine, and then the other one he fights so hard not to go to sleep. Like <laughs> it takes so long for him to go to sleep. Um, but back to what I was saying. So everything that I use with my iPhone is on my Apple credit card. So I'm applying that money to the Apple credit card. And I'm also taking whatever I have out of the Navy Federal card. I said a card, the envelope, and I'm putting it into the Apple one. And I'm going to just move the Navy Federal one to the back of my binder. Because I'm pretty sure at some point I'll charge stuff back on there, but no time soon. So let's deduct the 480 for my bills. And then the 130 for my cash envelope that I keep inside of my wallet and see what we have to work with. So we are working with $890. I'm going to write this at the top of the screen. Ew, that is ugly. <laughs> $890 is still ugly, but it's okay. And um, so I know my pay for the work that I did this week was $1,018. So 10% of that goes into my savings. It's 10180. I am going to round up. So we will be putting um 102. And normal this is so ugly. Why am I writing like this tonight? <laughs> 102. And normally I put 20% of all of my income into taxes. However, guys, it's the end of the year. I don't want to pay taxes so i'm not we'll figure it out next year <laughs> that probably sounds so bad but it's okay i promise you it it won't mess me up my aunt is actually going to show me um how to do my taxes um just because like the person who i go to to do my taxes she does charge me like a good bit to do my taxes so my aunt was like why don't you just do your own taxes and i was like you're right i should all right, so now we're working with $788. I know majority of that I want to put into my sinking funds. Um, and then some other I want to put into some of the savings challenges. And I know because of last week, I have to make up in my December monthly challenge. And I don't know exactly how much I need for that. So I need to have a good bit in savings challenges left over. So for family birthdays, 
and we're gonna need the calculator. Let's put 50. Date night, we'll do 30. And I'm doing a little bit more because I have a little bit more to work with. Family fun, it's cold. Um, I'll just put $20 in it just to give it something. The twins, you know, they get most of my money. I'm gonna give them, I'm gonna start with 100 and we'll come back if I need to. Miscellaneous, no, that's just for if I go over on anything in these envelopes, that is to cover it. It's not like I need to stuff that. Um, all of my categories are things that I actually spend money on. So I don't really have like any miscellaneous spending. Marco, I have not given him anything this week. Well, actually this whole month, I haven't given him anything. So I'm going to give Marco $30. Just because he's going to need dog food pretty soon. So yeah, beauty, we're going to give beauty $10. Gym, $10. Hair, I'm going to give hair 40 Investments, we are not doing just yet. My personal spending, I'm going to give myself... Let me give myself 60. I have something I want to do. Retirement is going to get 50. My friends, um, oh wait, shopping, we'll do $10. Um, the other birthday envelope, we'll put 40. Car maintenance, we'll do 40. Clothing. Nah, we won't put anything in there. Actually, I'm thinking about lowering some of these amounts. Because mm, I only got $2.98 left. And I know I want to do some challenges. Um, We might change some of this up. Let's just, let's just keep going. Health, I want to put about um, $60 into health. Because I did have to like purchase medicines and things like that. So I do need to cover that um holidays i'm gonna put 25. i think i'm gonna go back and change some of these other envelopes because it's not necessities um household ten dollars miscellaneous nothing giveaways i think i spent like a lot of money out of giveaways so i'm gonna do 40. business essentials 20. And we'll do 40 in my supplies as well. So if we keep it the way we have it, that's only $103 for my savings challenges. And that's just not going to cut it. So because some of these things are not super high priority for me right now, here's what we're going to do. Marco, his dog food is not that much. We're going to take 20 back. Hair, I literally am just stuffing that just to stuff it <laughs> um we'll do 10 personal personal and retirement i'm gonna give it i'm gonna give this one 10 and this one 20 and i know i haven't kept up on the calculator so 30 personal had what 60 i don't even remember guys i don't remember I'll go back and re-add these things. Um, this other birthdays, like I said, it's I have a birthday coming up, but um we don't know exactly what we're doing. So I'm just gonna do 10 into here. I'm gonna keep all of that the same. Family fun, we don't have anything planned. Date night, we don't have anything planned. So let's just do 25, 5, and I think I'm okay with that now. All right, so let's add these up really quick. 5, 5, 100, 10, 10, 10, 20, 10, and 2. and 40 that is 557 dollars 
So let's add all these up. So we have 480, 130, and 557. That's $1,167 minus the 1500 we are going to work with $333 for my savings challenges and that looks a lot better because I know that I need to finish up my December challenge. I want to put some money away for a vacation and some of my other challenges. So that's about what I wanted to do. I wanted to do not an even number, not 400 and 400, but somewhere around there. So let me just add this just to make sure it equals 890 and it does and that's what we had to work with. So <laughs> my budget with me video is actually a pretty short video. It actually didn't take longer than I thought, even though I hadn't pre-planned where I wanted to put money. So what I want to say, I forgot. Oh, <laughs> Merry Christmas, Happy Holidays to any holidays that you guys celebrate during this time. Um, I won't say Happy New Year's because I'm going to see you guys again before that. But enjoy you guys' holidays with your family. I hope everyone stays safe and warm because this is going to be a cold Christmas. Um, especially down here in the South. We haven't had a cold Christmas in a while. So, um, you guys have a good one. I will be back probably Monday or Tuesday for my cash stuffing. I'll probably do it Monday just to get it out the way. Because I have to do all my other videos. But if not, you guys will see me again on either Monday or Tuesday. But until then, goodbye.